Hey guys, Coravero76 here. Welcome back to Bergmoor with Farmer Beavis. Oh, it's not Fatmo Beavis anymore? No. We kinda we kinda tried to get rid of the smell. <laughs> in vain. Put a in it. In vain. And Toby Moby V1. Hey, hey. AKA jerk. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. Ooh, somebody's salty. I, I really come. <laughs> yeah, I'm a little bit salty. Yeah. I think I think we we got hooked up to the wrong water supply. It's no longer fresh water coming out of the shower. <laughs> but today I get a chance to drive the Akros. Um, we tried. Beavis is still unwilling to give up his MB truck. And Toby is gonna. Uh, Put a trailer next to the field for me, and um, he's gonna cultivate after that, right? Yep. Wait, 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 wait. wait. It was not about me giving up the MB truck. It was about you guys not wanting to sit in it. At least that was uh, that was what I remember from the discussion last night. Oh, am I blocking your your way? Mm hmm. I'm terrible. Sorry. Yeah, you're not. Let's see, that patch that we had here was wheat, right? A little patch on the yard. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And what is growing on the field? So wheat. wheat. What a coincidence. So allow me. The biggest harvest job of the season. Indeed. This is what you're gonna see for the next five episodes. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, man. I think I'm gonna have to do multiple trips here because yeah. I think the harvester is gonna be empty before I know it. Oh, I need to unfold the harvester, of course. Dum dum dum. Done. Two units. Oh, and now we have straw in the field. Whoops. On, on main farm. <laughs> we can't win, can we? Nope, we can't win. We can only lose. <laughs> so I think we're gonna have to do uh, some some foraging on the main yard as well now. Do we want to bail that patch or? I don't know, man. Um, that's that, that's such a big swath. The um... Baylor just gonna puke itself to death. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to get the big windrower for that as well. So, eh, I don't yeah. think so. Oh wait, I didn't do this right. <laughs> and I hit the sign again. Ah. Oh. At the end of the season, you you should make like a compilation of every time you you, you hit that sign. Then, yeah, yeah, it's a miracle sign. It keeps popping up every time, no matter how many times I knocked it down. Yeah, it's like <laughs> I don't accept your shenanigans. Right on. Let's keep on going. Dum dum dum. Dum dum dum. Dum 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 Just wanted to say, Bonanza. What, what, what is this gonna be? A, a cheap rehash of Bonanza? <laughs> <laughs> Oh wait, I, I forgot this is like professional farm sim 2018 and I have to connect the PTO shaft. Yeah, thanks for doing that. It kind of appeared on my screen. Oh, great. So that's... A, did it, you see it as well, Toby? Uh, I saw something. I didn't really... You didn't pay attention? Toby was like, ah, flashing warning sign. That's normal in a nurse's. <laughs> I'm in a Deutsch now. Yeah, that's that's ultra normal there. <laughs> it's 
it's like with an alpha. If there isn't some some red lamp flashing, something must be wrong. <laughs> hey, 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 hey! I take offense. I'll have you know, in my alpha, there is no red warning lights flashing whatsoever. I took them all out. <laughs> <laughs> you just oh. took a uh, black electrical tape and uh, taped it <laughs> across mm -hmm. the um, indicator lights. Wait. So I'm not the only one doing that? <sighs> Lucky me. Yeah, that was really weird. I, I had the message to connect the PTO shaft as well. And you were like, what? <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I've, I've, I was harvesting already, so I was like, what? what? What is the game doing to me now? And then and then you said it, and I was like, okay, now I know. It was Beavis. Yeah, of course. Hashtag blame Beavis. <laughs> Indeed. But yeah, that that's a little bit of a... A bug, I guess, in multiplayer with the uh, manual attachment script. Yeah, let's just yeah. say that. Wasn't anybody detaching it. <laughs> you wanna confess something there, Toby? <laughs> <laughs> nope. Nope. But I have a yellow thing laying on the floor in the Deutsch here that I don't know what to do with. I very much beg your pardon. Kara, <laughs> <laughs> what <laughs> what do we have to know about yellow things in the Deutsch? I don't know, but whatever. Yellow it is, rubbery Toby, things? Toby put it there. <laughs> sure he did. Welcome back to Lagmore. Thank you. Stuttering commands. Yeah. Okay, well then, just just do your thing without me, MB truck. Okay, it doesn't. <laughs> what? You are having issues as well? Um, minor issues. And what are the issues? Mm, only the cedar not working. I mean, it's um, kind of not a very in integral to part to um, the whole seeding experience. But yeah. So that cedar is useless. Um, at least on that field, because it's, um, am I hitting the wrong pedal? No. There we go. Because, um, yeah, it doesn't really, um, seed. Oh, and the seed, uh, the field, that's the field 27, right? Yes, where we were spraying manure and cultivating, and I was doing the slick as wheelies. So we better sell that thing off and buy a government, maybe? Um, yes, I will get to work on that. What a shame. I like that cedar, but oh well. Yeah. Cavernland is cool as well. And uh, didn't you use that thing? Even I mean, in single player, yes. Yeah. But that thing with single player and multiplayer, it's a world apart. Well, there are three different worlds actually. There is a single player. There is multiplayer um, that you mm. host locally. Mm -hmm. And then there is dedicated server, which is like the, it's like, um, yeah, um, single player is like, um, normal country. Where are you going? Who, me? Oh. Unloading. 
it, it from my perspective here it looked like you were just um, locked in and dashing around out of control <laughs> oh thanks thanks for all the trust you put in me Beavis uh, it was more me not trusting the connection <laughs> But okay. <laughs> I I fear uh, I fear to say this, but I think we actually I, I could have used two trailers on the field, but that's okay. I can unload. Oh, sorry. I I I, I didn't think you would get that much out of it. No, we'll see. We'll see. I've done two two uh, two times around the field now, and um, the combine is full. Not even two times. One and a half, maybe. When I um, get back from the dealership, I can bring out the, the second. Um, nah, it's a, it's okay. I, I can do. Uh, I can go unload. I mean, it's gonna keep my entry. It's gonna keep me busy. I mean, because I think this field is not gonna take me 30 minutes to harvest. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I'm not even making an effort at the moment. Yeah, how are you guys doing? It's been a while since we've uh, recorded. <laughs> yeah, holding up, holding up. Yeah, trying to. <laughs> mm -hmm. Always, always. And with you? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm pretty good. Busy. <laughs> Work yeah. is hectic as hell at the moment. Yeah, probably everybody trying to get their stuff done and delivered before the end of the year. <laughs> it's it's always um, at the end of the year. Most other companies they are um, they have like two weeks of Christmas holiday, so they they have limited capacity. And every time at the end of the year, all companies that all through the the rest of the year didn't find us, no, they find us, and all of a sudden. Because we yeah, are the only, we are the only one willing uh, to uh, to do the to do the uh, assignments for them. Yeah. Dum, dum, dum. That's the nice cedar you got there, Beavis. Mm -hmm. Thank you, thank you. That's what the ladies say. Ooh la la. I don't know what kind of bars you go to, but <laughs> I think you should change such establishments if they say that. Plot twist. Beavis doesn't go to bars. <laughs> <laughs> he goes to Mars. No, he is from Mars. Ah. You, uh, <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. That's why he's afraid of chicken. Yes. Yes. And yes. Because the chickens are spies. They know stuff. <laughs> if you think the Mossad is hardcore, you haven't seen chickens. Oh, I have seen chickens, but... <laughs> Never not chicken spies. N never studied Only them spicy that. chicken. <laughs> I, s I see a lot of chickens. And I go down the motorway in the wrong lane. <laughs> in his Ursus. <laughs> Souped yeah. up Ursus. Yeah, with the um, beacon lights going and everything. <laughs> The six meter front packer. Bunch of chickens. <laughs> Suck it, trash cans. Ah, oh, that felt good. <laughs> I noticed they were knocked over, so I had to do something about that. So, the real question is. 
Is Beavis able to seed corn now? Um, yeah, if I can stop uh, driving um, all over the place and actually head to the fields, then we can find out. So, um, I, I want to say a little bit, and I'm not gonna, this is not promotion or anything, but there's people asking for the download link of the Deutz, the 5130. Um, in one of my Belgique episodes, there's a download link there. But if you want to have it, you're gonna have to look for it. Make enough of Indeed. people. Ah, oh, dang it, then I'm gonna have to miss out on it then. Yep. <sighs> Toby can't have it. Yeah, and it's not um, us being nasty or something when we say stuff like that. It's just, um, yeah, sometimes you don't even remember yourself where you got the stuff from or um, which video you linked it in. And yeah, then something like that is oftentimes the best you can come up with it's like okay i know i put it somewhere in that series and i uh, if i'm gonna have yeah. to guess it's gonna be episode six or seven. Oh, so the plot thickens <laughs> and the seeding commences ah oh, that would fit really nicely into your lucius series uh, is what the have, plot thickens have, no have really no flashes in there with modelings. <laughs> yeah, that would wow, be. Wow, that that sounds like some, some freaking um, shit the CIA would pull, you know, like <laughs> like MK Ultra and Majestic 12 and stuff like that. I mean, gee, <laughs> get Bill Burns on the phone yeah. <laughs> and Chessy Ventura also while you at it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Well, Toby, I was wrong. Didn't need two trailers after all. Yeah. I'm not glad. I'm not glad that you're wrong. I'm just happy that I'm right. <laughs> <laughs> that right. was political. But yeah, leaves me to go um, sell off some crops, I guess. Yeah. A little bit more money so we can buy a few cool toys for next episode, hopefully. Yeah, in case some other stuff turns out as not working. <laughs> Which kind of seems to be the, <laughs> the running joke in the series. <laughs> we, <laughs> we get uh, equipment and it doesn't work. Well, we were kind of planning on buying the uh, the Rostelmash Forge Harvester as well, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. That means we could potentially get rid of that harvester that we have uh, lying behind the shed as well. What's this thing called again? The one you oh, put the in the Pettinger? Pettinger Max? Yep, the one you put on the front. Yeah, we we can see how things pan out. Oh, um, newsflash, did anyone try to use the um, bridge markers on the Coverland um, corn seeder yet? No, also no. useless. Ooh, totally. <laughs> it seems to be the, the running theme with the cover and stuff. The rich markers are like, um, yeah, fancy decorations. Maybe they're actually not rich markers. Maybe they're like, you know, like the um, old uh, S-Class used to have be before they had the actual park distance system where they just had these these little prongs that were pointing out that were kind of helping you guess the distance. Have you unfolded Maybe them? There is no option to unfold the rich markers on this one. Ooh, 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 ooh. 
think we're gonna have to bring the Ursus back to the shop. The ring Why? feels a little bit loose. Maybe we should add that um, stash of informational promotional Ursus material back under the driver's seat. Maybe that was <laughs> essential to the <laughs> structural integrity of the whole machine. Yeah, appears to be. Because I mean, the, the bottom layer kind of was fused with the paint job, so I just um, took a hammer and, and broke it out. <laughs> be gone, Ursus propaganda. Yeah, only be Estonian propaganda allowed here. Let's see, up at the sheep area is also a south point, right? Yes, um, that is Getreide Road. Right on, let's take this route then, so I can see Beavis and Toby in action. Oh. Looking hey. good, Kara. Wait. That looks awesome. Wait, wait. Honk, 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 honk. They forgot to fix the horn. Yeah, I would stop and wave to you, but I was, I'm afraid this uh, thing will never start moving again. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna put this thing in the in the BJ. That thing isn't biodegradable. Chernobyl is more biodegradable than that thing. <laughs> I, I, I wonder if you put an Ursus in the BJ, would you get the manure bonus? Uh, no, the um, pity bonus. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm gonna shut up now. <laughs> oh, and there we have Farmer Beavis. Yeah. Honk, honk, honk. As I totally uh, fail to hit the right button, and probably have uh, messed with the time acceleration now. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Only a little bit. Yeah. Beavis is, is such an idiot. His, his idiocy throws off the, the very scale of time and space. So, there we have that. Now I have three less minutes to get all crops sold off. Thanks, Beavis. Yeah, thanks, Beavis. Thanks for putting the pressure on. Yeah. Everybody comment blame beavers if you have watched this far. And if you have made it this far into the episode, you get a free compliment complimentary nothing. Yeah, in a nice um, basket of meh. <laughs> Indeed. Wrapped in a shell of empty. <laughs> in a bottomless bag with no sides. And if you call now, it's only it's gonna one if, if you time call shipping and handling. And if you call now, it's going to be hand delivered by Ad Zachary. <laughs> oh, Ad Zachary. Uh, he's, he's a busy fellow, so... You better call now. The number is now flashing across the screen. It's 1-800-TOBs. I repeat, 1-800-TOBs. Yeah, this episode went down the drain in no time. Mm -hmm. so, so is the ozone layer, thanks to the smoke coming out of this Ursus. What are you tanking in this thing, dude? Uh, you, you know what used engine on? <laughs> I think everywhere I drive, the, the leaves just fall off the tree spontaneously. Yep. Ah, that's being have a beavis having a leak in the tank, I think. Hey, but I must say, I support your idea of having the uh, the what's what's this, what's that tractor called again? Uh, the Zitter? 
Oh the yeah, the Centaur Crystal one? Yeah, reskin to analysis. Mm -hmm. That one was pretty awesome. Dum dum dum. Oh, and for everybody wanting to know why it's such a good idea, you're going to have to watch Toby Moby's latest Poppenborg episode, where he explains in very good detail why it's a good idea. Ah, oh, you've seen that. I totally forgot about that. <laughs> yeah, I do watch little farms now and then. Not a lot, not a whole lot, but a little. I mean, I always watch Toby Moby because I want to learn from the expert. The silence. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'm not used to having that kind of at mainstream me. attention. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's kind of like saying PewDiePie is watching your videos, so... <laughs> indeed, indeed, indeed. Click that link, everybody. Click that link. So, about okay. the payment, Toby, um, <laughs> I'll take Just cash only. Hong <laughs> <laughs> Kong! Well... <laughs> and... Uh, I, I do I appreciate it but I don't want uh, another edition of uh of Ursus. <laughs> I mean it 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 cost me all of the, the money you gave me last time to oh. get through therapy so <laughs> Oh I thought you you used it for a color thing for your printer. <laughs> <laughs> that, yeah but um... it was only grayscale. Ah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That um, Bosch well, that, that was make an addition was too much. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> indeed. I mean, stirring with the saggy old. Ugh. Splooch, splooch, splooch. And I missed my exit. <laughs> yeah, I wonder what. Uh, what Stone Cold Steve Austin would think if he actually knew what what he was saying when he said he was the toughest SOP WWE. <laughs> <laughs> wow, the Earth just got stuck in the grate. Yeah, the grate is pretty hardcore. It <laughs> it stops the whole track. Holy mother of lag. Yeah, but, but I got stuck on there with the MB truck as well, so it's like, I don't know. Welcome yes. to the narrow streets of Bergmore. <laughs> mm -hmm. Where everybody hates your face. And they're never glad you came. Beavis is so excited, he started seeding the other side of the field as well. On the other side of the road. I did what now? <laughs> I saw <laughs> you coming from the other side of the field, you're making a big turn. Yeah, it, it was more like um, my, my, my my fat belly being in the way of the steering wheel, but anyhow. <laughs> Not yeah. really, but my story and I'm sticking to it. Maybe you should just grow longer arms than these. Very funny. <laughs> that's that, 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 that's like saying to, to a child who was hard by contact a gun, well no arms, no cookies. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> you know, it's like uh. <laughs> 
<laughs> well, way to get Beavis salty. <laughs> <laughs> Off to the Beavistonian salt mines with you. Be gone. <laughs> Have they opened them up again? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. After we, <laughs> we got rid of those UN labor inspectors. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, did, did, did I say get rid of them um, <laughs> after they had a, a tragic accident <laughs> involving a mining truck? But anyhow. Another tragic accident. Was Lucius at the mine? No. I just. Um, yeah, was supervising the day shift at the rail yard. <laughs> Could have something to do with it. <laughs> I'm horrible. Yes, you are. Yeah. Those concrete boxes are horrible as well. <laughs> F cops, jeez. So all of this corn is going to be turned into silage, right? Yeah. Right on. Village. Silage. Silage. Then, um, Alpha Box is gonna, um, revamp the, the big hit. Big in Silage. No takers? No takers today. Okay, that was that was terrible even for my low standards. <laughs> and that's shocking news. What's Beavis what's the like standards? having? What's it like having such things? I don't know. Ascara. I only have stand-ups and mods. Oh. It has to be washable. Is this Ursus washable? No. Rubbish. Yeah, that's kind of sad. It's kind of sad that there's no really good Ursus mods out at the moment. Yes, it is. There was one, but that got ruined by 1.3. Yep, and unfortunately never updated. Yeah. Thanks, 1.3. And thanks, 1.4, for not fixing it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't even know if it did, actually. I haven't checked that. Well, 1.4 was a bit of a choke update anyhow. I mean... <laughs> I think it broke more things than it fixed. I... Uh, oh, wait. There's, I think there's one thing that I know that's gotten broken. That's the placeable straw power plant. Yeah, which is bad enough. Um, it got broken? Yeah, I, I, we had issues with it on here. So we actually initially thought it was a multiplayer uh, problem. Mm -hmm. But I placed one down on Belgique the other day and um, no bueno. What? What's the issue? I can't tap into it anymore. That is that is the end of um, of straw power plant goodness on Baldacino as well. Then I didn't notice because I used it uh, the other day. Have you used it the other day? I, it might and be an issue with my uh, with my forage wagon then. And but I uh, I dumped into it with the uh, front loader. Hmm. Oh, well, that that could be then. Um, you know, with the logging. Oh, wow. With the logging forks? Yeah. You just unlocked and tip and they fell in. I uh, didn't know if I get it, got any money from it, <laughs> but... <laughs> I saw some sparks flying out of it, so yeah. it must have been good. Mm -hmm. 
He heard some, some painful screams of, of the innocent worker that, that he grabbed with the fork, but... <laughs> and the bailer. <laughs> yeah. Now, what, you... You just uh, loaded some straw into there with the front loader, right? Yeah, yeah, just, just mm. normal straw bale. I must Ramp. have another go at it then. No, that was uh, uh, a bale, grass bale, pilot bales. Yeah, I think it was silage bales because I had issues with trying the Ultima and... Wait, are we talking about the placeable straw power plant now or about the biomass heating plant? Placeable straw power plant? Placeable straw okay. power plant. Still rubbish. Does the biomass heating plant take... Yes. Bales? Ah. I don't know. Bales, I don't know. Should. Yeah, I'm gonna have to try that uh, straw power plant with some bales then. Could actually be nice, have a little shed near to it, fill it up with bales. Mm -hmm. I support that. Yeah, but there was something just kind of cool about the um, straw power plant. Yeah, and you used to be able to just uh, drive over the over it with the uh, thingy do for. Yeah. So beavers. Oh, mm. never mind. Here's the wool pallet. Never mind. I kind of was worried that the wool pallets appeared at the little st where we stored the bales. But never mind. I found no, no, them. I um, checked it out beforehand. Ah, good, good. Because usually where this uh, wood pallet appears is like this uh, little raised wooden platform. Mm -hmm. So, how far along are you guys? Mm -hmm. Almost all the way yeah, across. Done. Just needing the uh, advance done. Oh, very good then. I think that's a good time to end the episode because it's 38 minutes now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, then let's do such things. Um, yeah, you guys know the drill. Leave a like if you mm -hmm. enjoyed the episode. Bosch, if Makita, Black and Decker, old drills. Oh, that wasn't what you're talking about? Oh, I'm sorry. If you call me that one more time, I'm gonna have to stab you something. <laughs> no, I'm gonna say thank you all for watching. <laughs> yeah. And it hurts like hell, I tell you. Yes. <laughs> But yeah, um, I guess this is us signing out, and, and we shall see you next time when I stutter across the roads. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, see ya. See ya, guys. Take care. Bye bye. Yeah.